Hi everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's been a while and I'm happy to be back. This week's video is going to be about outfits I put together with the same skirt, same purse and same sneakers. What they all have in common is the color, so it's all white. And basically I just decided to create those outfits so you can see how much you can make of just one bottom, in this case the skirt, but just in general just with one piece of clothing that you have and see how many times you can use it over and over again in completely different ways. And I feel like this is kind of important because it helps you buy less, obviously you are just creating more than just one or two outfits with the same clothing and just make the most of what you already have. I feel like maybe we sometimes lack of creativity. By the way, I got rid of a bunch of clothing that I already have and donated it because I couldn't even make some space in my garments anymore to reach the garments in the back of my closet. So I got sick of it and I can like finally open up my closet, like all the clothing pick up whatever I want in the back. Even though I did this, I still feel like I have a lot. I'm going to try to show you how much you can make from the little you still have. So anyways, let's just go straight to the outfits I managed to prepare for this week. So as I said, we have three items I've been wearing in all these outfits. And the first one is this white mini skirt. I bought it in H&M. I'm just going to mention this skirt is so badly done. At first view, you won't be able to tell because the fabric, the first fabric is fine, totally normal, but the line is so big that whenever I'm trying to iron it, it's never flat the way I desire. So basically it doesn't matter how much I iron this skirt because of the lining being so big, there are always wrinkles and it's so annoying. So I was thinking I'm going to try to fix the lining. So I finally have a flat, you know, fabric because otherwise it looks messy. You might see it on the pictures unless I've photoshopped all the wrinkles. But anyways, I I have this white mini skirt that I love. Definitely a spring summer skirt because, well, it's quite light as a fabric. I love it because of the split here on the tie. I feel like it's very sexy and it gives a sophisticated and classy touch too, which I love. I wore the same white little purse here. I bought on AliExpress about like two years ago, I think now. And then bought it with those super simple white Adidas sneakers which I love and wear almost always in pretty much every single outfit. I also think I'm wearing them so often because I feel like I look taller than in my all source for instance. Because it makes me taller, I feel like it also makes me fitter and skinnier. Maybe it's just me being too focused on the way I look, I don't know, but I like it. So I fitted this skirt with this super simple cropped up t-shirt I bought last summer. As I've said in all the previous videos where I'm wearing this shirt, I am obsessed with it. I just love it overall. I feel like this crop top is just so cool. And I bought it in Bershka in Sardinia. I like this fit because it's very girly, but very chill, streetwear and cool at the same time. And this is honestly such a comfortable outfit to wear too. I love this outfit. I know I'm going to wear it so often too. So this was a very simple and easy outfit to put together. You are literally wearing only like two items, this crop top and this skirt and all is done. It's perfect the way it is. Any kind of simple crop top you have or I'm pretty sure even a longer just a t-shirt might fit super easily too and not make it seem too loose, to not put together. I feel like there's always ways to make outfits nice and stylish, especially with accessories. If you have necklaces, like all kind of accessories that would make the outfit even better, just go for it. I feel like accessories are always details that maybe are overlooked. Then we can go straight to the second outfit. I actually wore this specific outfit for my niece's birthday. I actually had 
a, a very like a ponytail but then in a braid. I love this outfit so much and it wasn't that warm either so I feel like this kind of crop top shirt is very effective for evenings maybe when it's not that warm yet because it keeps you warm where it needs to be warm enough to not get ill. I feel like with the sleeves and this very short color it makes it even more elegant and chic and obviously more sporty because of the white sneakers. Also the colors are very fresh which I love too. I love when you know people just do not wear all black or just very dark colors because when you go outside that's pretty much everything you see and I feel like it's always nice to see someone like dressed with fresh colors and I feel like there's just so much more life. They just basically look more like happy which I like. I love this outfit. I feel like it's very sweet, adorable, super cute, girly and so comfortable. So so comfortable. What I actually like about this mini skirt too is the fact that it's not too tight and just like loose enough to feel comfortable in it. So then we have this third outfit which I feel like I love. I really like it. I just, I don't know, like the details of the colors makes me look like a, how do you say this in English? Um, in French we say bon chic, bon genre, BCBG, old money aesthetics. It's probably because of the type of skirt I'm wearing with a combination of the fabric of the shirt and this very elegant color. So we have this shirt as I was talking about, bought it in Bershka 2 last summer. I combined it with this super cute blues that actually belongs to my mom and I think she had this from when she was 20 something years old so that would be from probably the 90s could be like from early definitely early 90s maybe late 80s something like that I took it from her when she was when I was a teenager and always kept it look at this beautiful loose there are so many details. First of all, the super cute buttons. Then, as you can see, this color made in lace. How chic is that, honestly? Then the fabric. Hopefully you can see the fabric. It's very soft too. Then there are like shoulder pads here. I would figure out to make an outfit where you actually can see me wearing this shirt because in the outfits you will see, it's always covered with something above it. And then you have those puffy short sleeves, which are adorable too. You can see also those lines here. In French we say une pince, with which is basically fabric that you close together to make a garment close fitted. You have this like on the front and on the back too, as you can see. Honestly, this shirt is just so lovely and I adore it. I've always loved this one. Okay, no, it is cotton and 45% polyester. Okay, cool. Anyways, I like this outfit because of how classy it is and stylish. It's just so well put together and I feel like those small details of this color and then the fabric here are just amazing together. It just gives so much to the outfit that you don't necessarily need much of jewelry, for instance. But I adore this outfit. I felt super cute and girly in it, so well dressed. So you can see again here like the difference with this outfit and the two previous ones, which are completely different. And it shows again how much you can do from combining just one item you have with any other kind of top you already have too. There are just so many options. And then we have this Ford adorable outfits wearing all white all the same and, and then I added this item this little yellow super cute cardigan over the white blues I just showed you. I wear this garden very this garden this cardigan this cardigan very warily. I never really know with what to wear it so I guess like every time I'm putting outfit together I try to use it. I feel like it fitted quite well here too and it added a little bit of color as everything is white here obviously but it's H&M I don't know how many years ago. I feel like this outfit is so so cute. I actually really like it because I usually never really know with what to wear this cardigan. It gives me like hope in 
a way that I didn't bought it for nothing. And it changes a little bit of the usual stuff I would wear. Overall, as you can see, the white of the skirt and the blues are not exactly the same, but it's not disturbing either, which is nice. I feel like they actually blend well together, like it melts well together and doesn't make it look wrong. You can see a little bit more of the details of the white blues. You can see the color more clearly, also the buttons and the fabric in itself obviously and then the details coming out of the sleeves of the yellow cardigan. So yeah, I feel like this is actually a nice outfit because of all the important details you can see from the white blues and then without hiding the beautiful details of the yellow cardigan again too. So yet again a super lovely outfit and refreshing too with those colors and then we go back to the gray color as the first outfit. To not make it too dark I decided to actually keep the white blues and just as this velvet dark gray t-shirt. Super comfortable t-shirt to wear too. I bought it in Terra Nova a few years ago and I still love this one so so much. I do wear it quite often too actually. You can see the the details of the puffy sleeves coming on the bottom of this velvet t-shirt and the details of the color which gives a nice touch to the outfit again and doesn't make the outfit too basic, too simple, too empty at the same time because if I didn't have this detail of color I probably would have added some kind of necklace maybe or basically anything that wouldn't make the outfit too plain. Otherwise I feel like it just missed something. But anyways, I feel like those two tops fit so well together. I'm actually glad I managed to use these blues more than once. Shows again for the hundredth time how much you can do from so little garments and make the most of it. I love this outfit too, by the way. I think it's very lovely, very cute, perfect for spring too because of the layers and the thickness of this shirt too. And it keeps you warm still, so that's really nice. And if you see in previous videos you will see how much I love when some colors cut in a outfit. So super chic, classy and a little bit sporty at the same time with the sneakers which I like so much. Next week you might see other outfits with the same skirt, I'm not sure, I will see. I am glad I found those five new outfits to wear and especially for spring and summer I think it's going to be so nice, super comfortable to wear to go to lunch with or do any other kind of activity I would like to do here in London. But yeah, so that's about it and I hope you like them too. Let me know in the comments below what your thoughts are about those outfits. If you enjoyed watching this video, please give it a like. Also subscribe to my channel if you want to keep up with all the next videos I'm going to make. And if you want to see more of my previous ones where I'm trying other kind of outfits with the garments I already have too, go for it. And hopefully it's going to inspire you to do as much as possible with everything you have. That's about it, so I hope to see you next week. Bye!